A very good morning to you. This is this really is going to be a brief video because from I finished shooting yesterday's video, um, which I think was round about three o'clock in the afternoon, um, and I started uploading it at that time straight away. It was gone midnight last night. I think it was, yeah, I think it was past midnight before it was actually up and loaded. I mean, it was just ridiculous. So I'm just going to keep videos quite short now until normal service resumes, as I'm sure it will at some point. Um, we'll see how things go after Monday night when, when people leave the west of Ireland and go back to the east after the bank holiday weekend. Anyway, just a short video because I want to share with you what, what it is I'm doing. I've been trimming back the bay, one of the very many bay trees here, and I've also been harvesting the poppies and the fever few, and I'll show you just over here what I'm doing with them. So you can see there's a, a massive amount of poppies and fever few, which have just stood up there against the wall and the table to start drying out because I want to harvest all that seed. And I'll do it um, without too much ceremony. I shall just uh, allow them to dry and then um, go through them, take out those beautiful poppy seed heads, um, put them in a place where I can put them into um, nice displays over the course of the of the autumn and winter and spring. The fever few, the seed heads should dry pretty quickly. I'll be able then just to go through those, take the seed heads out, put them into um, brown paper bags and keep them then just to scatter around. Or I might even just go and scatter them around as they dry. Because of course that's nature's way. As the seed dries, she then allows the wind to carry the seed if there is wind or if not, just to let the seed fall. And that will germinate in its own time in the following spring and early summer. Um, one other thing I, I wanted to say, because as I was working and I, and I work in um, a very meditative way, one of the reasons why I love the physical work that's involved here at Bealtaine. Um I was thinking to myself uh, of videos that I've watched recently and uh, the one thing that stood out has been the, the growing hatred, um, hatred at the worst, scornfulness and derision at the best um, of attitudes towards women. And I've noticed that um, there, there are many men out there who are using the word bitch against women and also talking about women in quite derogatorily um, sexual ways and um, referring to women um, as, oh, um, uh, um, uh, if I had a woman here, you know, um, this is what she should be doing, you know, basically servicing him in a sexual way and cooking. And, you know, it's just, it really is quite dreadful. And it does, it does uh, make me think of something that my grandmother said. And my grandmother was such a, such a wise, wise Irish woman. And um, uh, towards people like that, um, it was basically, you know, pay, pay no heed to him, pay no attention to him. What she would say, and this is a wonderful saying, I wouldn't give him the time of day. I wouldn't give him the time of day. And uh, that really means that, you know, uh, um, even if someone stopped and asked you the time, that kind of a person, you wouldn't even give them the time of day. And you wouldn't even say hello in passing, which of course is a huge insult here in Ireland. Because in Ireland, it's very important to always salute the stranger, as they say, 
um, and and uh, people who visit Ireland remark afterwards of how many people waved at them on the side of the road or waved at them from another car and they imagined that uh, that this person recognised them. But it is of course just um, um, the, 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 the good manners to salute the stranger and uh, if someone asks you, you know, the time, you say, OK, well, this is the time. But also it means, because it's quite metaphorical, it means, you know, I wouldn't actually have anything to do with them. Um, so in metaphor, that's what I wouldn't give them the time of day means. I would have nothing to do with them. And sure, why would you? So that's what I was thinking about just as I was doing this beautiful morning work. And it doesn't make me it doesn't make me angry or anything like that because um, I steer away from such negative emotions. But it 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 does make me aware of um, attitudes towards female and ultimately attitudes towards Mother Earth. And uh, is it an, is it is it is it little wonder that we are where we are at this point in time? in regard to the state of our beautiful planet. Blessings to you all.